I have the OnePlus 7 Pro here and today I'm going to show you how to remove the Netflix application and uninstall it on both the OnePlus 7 as well as the OnePlus 7 Pro. So if you have either of these devices, at least on the OnePlus 7 Pro, I noticed that the Netflix application was pre-installed. This is pretty rare for OnePlus. I'm, I'm not sure if this is the first time they've done this, but they usually shy away from pre-installing applications. However, we have the Netflix application here installed, and there is no way to normally, I'll say normally, uninstall the application. So by normally, I mean that, so see I have this join application, it's installed from the Google Play Store. If I were to go into the application info page, I have an uninstall button, I can uninstall it right there. However, the Netflix application is not like that because it is a pre-installed application, meaning it cannot be easily uninstalled. So if you have the Netflix application installed and you want to get rid of it, I want to show you two different ways that you can do that. One is a, I mean, they're both rather easy, but one is easier than the other since it does not involve ADB. And I'm going to show you how to do that one first. So the first method I want to show you is to just disable the Netflix application. I mean, that really is all you need to do if you want. So to do that, we're going to open up the settings application. We're going to tap on apps and notifications. And if you need to tap that see all apps button, go ahead and tap that. Uh, we just need to get to the Netflix application from here. Either way. So once we are here, instead of the uninstall button, we have the disable button. And we can easily disable that from right here. You disable the app, Android and other apps may no longer function as needed. Since Netflix is a major third party app, it's not going to break anything or uh, cause any other functions to not um, work properly. So we're just going to tap on the disable app button and then it's you can see that button changed from disabled to enable. That means the application is disabled as you can see right up there and the application icon is gone. It's not in our app drawer and it's nowhere to be found because it has been disabled. So for the most part that's really all you need to do to uninstall the Netflix application. With it disabled, that means it cannot run, it cannot use up any battery life, it cannot eat up any system resources or anything. However, if you want to take this a step further, we can. And before that, I want to show you, we can go right back through here. We can look at our disabled apps, and if we want, we can enable that application again. And you're going to see that application has been added back to the app drawer. So, that's how to disable the Netflix app, which, for the most part, is what most people need. They just want to remove it. They don't want to see it in the app drawer. They don't want to have it use any system resources or anything like that. So that's what most people will do. However, if you want to take this a step further, we can do that with a more advanced t technique using ADB. So to do that, we need to have USB debugging mode installed. And if you're not familiar with how to do that, be sure to look in the video description on YouTube if you're watching this on YouTube and you'll find a link to the step-by-step -step instructions on how to enable USB debugging mode. In that full tutorial on my website I will also be including the upcoming ADB commands that we'll be, we will be using to uninstall, actually uninstall, the Netflix application from our current Android user. 
So it's a little more of a uninstall than just disabling it. But the end result is the same, meaning that the applic application icon is gone. It cannot eat up your battery life. And, that can, it can, and it cannot use any system resources just being there. And you'll see that with a lot of like applications that even if you don't use Facebook or even if you don't use Instagram, you will see it pop up on the battery charts every now and then. So if you want to do that, again, we need to have USB debugging mode enabled, and then we're going to need to have ADB and Fastboot tools installed. You can see I have the USB cable connected here. And we're going to open up a command prompt and enter the ADB shell for the OnePlus 7 Pro. So just as I mentioned, we are going to be opening up a command prompt. You can use a Windows PowerShell or a terminal. And with the OnePlus 7 or OnePlus 7 Pro connected to the computer with the USB cable, we type out the command ADB space shell and press enter that will start our ADB service if it is not running already and then it will enter us into a ADB shell prompt from within our device so with that prompt here the OnePlus 7 or the OnePlus 7 Pro we're gonna type out the command PM space uninstall space k dash k space dash dash user space zero and this can be used to uninstall a lot of bloat or pre-installed applications because we're just going to be putting a space after that main command and then putting the package name for that Netflix application which in this case is com dot Netflix dot media client Again, all of these are going to be listed in the full tutorial on my website, so if you want, you can just copy and paste these commands instead of typing them out. What we're doing here is we are initializing the package manager. We're telling it to uninstall the Netflix application from user zero, which is you. I mean, it's the default user. If you have multiple user profiles, that'll be different. You know, you might want to change this to one or two, but for the most part, most people only use one profile, so we would just want to uninstall it from user zero. So once you have all that typed out, I'm going to show you what happens when we press enter on the keyboard by showing you on the smartphone. So I just wanted to change cameras again to show you. Now we still have that command prompt up. We have the Netflix application here. I just want to show you that whenever we press enter on the keyboard, the Netflix application disappears. We get a, a success message in our command prompt. And when we try to find that application, the Netflix application, we see it here but we're told it is not installed for this user. Which, again, like I told you, we have uninstalled it for our current user. So it's really, again, it's really just the same as before. It's still disabled, it cannot be opened, it's not in the app drawer. And there we have it. That is how to remove and uninstall the pre-installed Netflix application from the OnePlus 7 and the OnePlus 7 Pro.